hello guys um, so today let's see how to recover um, corrupted file in WinRAR or in 7 zip okay so as you have a file that's uh, I have downloaded but even I'm struggling like you know how to achieve this so let's see how to quickly recover or like you know uh, a solution for it for this so this is a file called imp file when I'm opening this file um it's prompting an error right i'm like unexpected end of archive right? so whatever i try like you know i i'm not able to uh, retrieve my files okay like uh, so these are my files listed over here right and when i try to click and like you know try to extract whatever i, I want to do but it's not allowing me to do so the result is the archive is cor corrupted right Okay, whatever I try, like you know, if I do want to extract it to the to my desktop or whatever it is, it's prompting me an error. Okay, so whatever ways I try, um, it's not helping me out. Okay, I do want to extract it to the, to the desktop, right, and unable to do so. Okay, nothing is being pushed. So how to? Let's try something else if I can achieve this folder is blank nothing is retrieved right so I'll try to extract here unable to do so right um, extract to IMP file unable to do so right whatever I try like no the result is same okay so the solution for this is let's try like you know I'm not even like hundred percent confident even it's gonna work for me but uh, there is some alternative okay so let's quickly go on browser like whatever it is that is safari for macbook or like you know google chrome mozilla firefox or whatever it is i'm using my microsoft edge i'll try to download 7 zip um, for my laptop okay i'll try to download um click on advanced continue to 7 zip okay so based on your mm, windows operating system like whether it's like 64 bit or 32 bit download uh, the 7 zip file if you are not aware how to check whether your um, windows is like you know 64 bit or uh, of 32 bit quickly press window plus r or you can search and type like you no know, run or whatever you feel comfortable of click on run and type dxdiag okay and hit enter so it will list out like you no know, everything uh, that your like you know um, system is having like like windows like 64 bit um, or 32 bit operating system which uh, like you know um, operating system you are using language system manufacturer etc okay like list of like everything like you know you can see over here okay if you click on next page as well you'll see the chip type right you know like, like much more information right so i'll go to system part and i'll see my windows 10 of my operating system is windows 10 and of 64 bit right so i'll just quickly close this so i'll download 7 zip of 64 bit okay once i'll click on download um it's showing an error because like you know this site is not having a necessary certificate like you know it's an not secure site but anyway i'm going to proceed further clicking on continue okay now my file will start downloaded okay now it's like you can see it's downloaded okay i'll go in the folder okay and I'll run this. I'll double click on it. Okay, I'll try to install this file. I don't know why it is leading me to here. Uh, not really sure why. Let's quickly paste it over desktop and I'll run it. Okay. Mm, let's wait and see seems okay 
app you are trying to install is under Microsoft Verified app. Okay, I'll just change my settings for this video part. Okay, even because that file is important for me and I do want to download that file. Um. Okay. For Windows 10, even I have to seek like you know how to approve. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's try. Because even this thing is new for me. I'm just trying. Okay, I think this is not the one. I think I have to click over here and anyway okay so this is the way you can tweak and turn uh, the setting okay like I'll click anyway before it was like you know uh, installed application should be from my Microsoft Store only that was it is selected by default and it was recommended okay uh, for the safety of Windows and OS but I'll click anyway right now and I'll again try to install uh, this 7 zip now it is allowing me to do so right okay so i'll just click on s install um let's wait okay then it's installed click on close um i can't see it uh, it's not in desktop i think it's installed somewhere here 7 zip i'll just search it okay Seven zip app manager open. Okay, now I'll quickly go and add. Oh, ho, it's not supporting me. Okay, I'll just go just like you know, I, I have to fetch this file, right? So, what I'll do, I'll click on let's see, I can, either I can drag or not. I think I can drag it, right. So I just dragged this file over here or what you can do is like you know you can uh, navigate to the directory of desktop or either it's in D drive, E drive or C drive whatever it is based on your uh, local preference of uh, your file like you know you can navigate to computer right or documents or wherever it is and you can pick this file okay or you can quickly uh, do as I did. Um, drag and drop this file over this window right uh, and then it will uh, try to extract okay now I can see now one file is being generated right it is being uh, generated right it is being processed so let's see that it helps or not okay even I'm not sure but let's try so my total size is 451 MB right and 129 MB is being is already processed and so here you can see the process okay and how long it's gonna take it's gonna take almost around like two minutes as per this application so let's wait okay have have that patience okay let's see either it works or not so this even I just ran out into a problem today morning I was trying to work on some PDFs and I just downloaded this file from the web now I'm not able to extract okay but this file is really important for me and I don't want to lose anything and let's see like past like before a year I think I did the same and it, it and it worked out for me but uh, let's see that I can extract this file or not okay so let's wait a um, couple of minutes more And yes, I'm really sorry for the audio part. I'm having a very hard time for uh, fixing out my like you know laptop um, audio part and even f my headset. So I quickly try to purchase a new one and like you know I'll 
fix this fix that out okay my fingers are crossed <laughs> let's see that i can or not but uh, okay i can see one file right that is being created that's that's been created okay okay now this is the file if i'll double click it it's showing me processing again so this is the new file okay important file 2.7 uh, this is the main file that I uh, dragged over here and this is the second one okay so I just opened it and let's see either I can fetch out my contents or not uh -huh. oh it's again the same right let's extract to keep broken files desktop okay close i think i'm not able to um i'm just deleting this file it's not work working what i'll do i'll try to see um user okay and my local username is ashish okay and i'll quickly go to desktop and i'll pick that file that's important file right this, this is the one okay i'm navigating from here only just i'm just giving a try okay now i'll click on this and extract okay I think now I'm able to like you know extract those files, right? Um, so either way, like you know, I I have I, I as I said, like you know, I tried a year before, but I think uh, this is the way how we can like you know uh, re retrieve the files. Okay, uh, let's see, let's wait again. Okay, so one file is corrupted. Seems I think there is an error for one file. Okay, um, this. CRC failed. It means cyclic redundancy check. Okay, CRC failed. So I'll just quickly close and let's see either this folder is having those documents or not that I'm expecting for. Okay, I'll quickly go. Boom! Right, I'm able to extract these files, guys. Right. So I know this thing is a bit. I just try to open either. I'll try to check either I can open it or not. Um. Uh huh. Yes, I can open those files. I can't show you so these files, right? It's in video, but yes, I'm able to. Okay. So this is how you can even do if you ran into this sort of problem, right? I hope. Um. See, like I I do have plenty of files, right? Um. Extracted sixty four items in total, right? So this is how you can even like you know um extract uh, your files if you ran into some sort of like this similar issues um so that's all yep thank you so much for watching this video and i hope you like this video and i hope this will be helpful for you even um so yes thank you so much for watching see you until next time bye bye